Hello everyone. First lesson for the subject or the course uh, Mathematics in the Modern World is the Mathematics in Our World. Now let's talk about this one. The learning outcomes for this are identify the patterns in nature and regulations in the world, articulate the importance of mathematics in one's life, and express appreciation of mathematics as human endeavor. Now, um, I know that all of you know, singa sa palibot nato, there are a lot of patterns present. Bali, we can see that one sa mga hayop, sa mga plants, sa mga bundok, sa mga sanina, sa design sa mga balay, and etc. Now, as you can see, we have pictures here. We have the tiger stripe, the spindle work with threefold symmetry, honeycomb, a nate. A natural tessellation, um, snowflakes with six-fold symmetry, sunflower, and hyena. Uh, I mean, hyena spot. So, ano ang common sa anim na pictures that I presented? The common for the six pictures is they all follows a pattern. There is a s certain pattern for each of the following or each of the pictures. Um, how does this relate to the topic mathematics in our world all of those pictures are present in our world and all of those patterns are present in mathematics all of those patterns are explained or can be explained by mathematics say for example John sa picture natin a honeycomb in nature tessellation um, the explanation kung bakit hingana ang ang forma sa ilahang beehive or yeah take a look at that one hingana ang ilahang um pagkahimo ana is para daghan daw og mahimo nga mga butanganan og honeys para sa ilahang bali murag daghan ilahang tambakanan og honeys kay if circle na siya there are tendencies nga kung circle ka syempre na ay mga butas-butas pa na ay mga daghan kaayo nga um, bakante but if you are using a 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 nga side six sided nga polygon and that is a hexagon mas magamit nimo ang sides nga i mean a tibuok area walay masayang area because magamit siya if ang you are using the hexagon now um sa sunflower this follows also a pattern we can have i mean it follows the fibonacci sequence na ano pattern okay now let's proceed to the abstraction patterns and numbers in nature and in world when we talk about patterns Patterns are regular, repeated, or recurring forms of designs. They are more commonly observed in natural objects, such as the six-fold symmetry of snowflakes, the hexagonal structure of and formation of honeycomb, the tiger stripes and hyena spots, the number of seeds in a sunflower, and the spiral of a snail's shell. Also, the number of petals of flowers. Mauna siya ang mga natural patterns nga itong makita. Humans are hardwired to recognize patterns. Um, the formal system of thought developed by human mind and culture for recognizing, classifying, and exploiting patterns is called mathematics. Again, siya ha? Um, the formal system, the formal system thought developed by human mind and culture for recognizing, classifying, and exploiting patterns is called mathematics. So, ano ba siya? Ano ba talaga ang mathematics? Mathematics is perceived as a study of numbers, symbols, and equation as an art of geometric shapes and patterns. It is a universal language. It is a tool. I mean, uh, this is O. It is a tool in decision making and problem solving and a way of life to be exact and precise 
Mathematics is a study of patterns, an art, a language, a set of problem-solving tools, and a process of thinking. So, ano siya? When we talk about mathematics, dili lang sa pasabot nga numbers lang. There are also symbols, patterns, shapes, and anything nga ma-relate na to sa mathematics. Dili lang dyan sa focus sa number o sa solving. Anything nga ato ang makita sa palibot is actually can be explained by mathematics. Later on, as we go deeper sa ito ang discussion, sa ito ang mga um, topics, we will understand how how mathematics works in our daily living. Now, so that's it for now. Next video, we will have the Fibonacci sequence. I will give um, examples for the Fibonacci sequence. So, for now, yana muna. That is for the patterns and numbers in nature and in world and the world. Thank you so much. Have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye.